my name is Guillaume Delvigne. Um, I'm a designer for 10 years now and I founded this uh, small studio. Um, we are three people um, working on different projects like, uh, like um, products uh, and um, furniture pieces, lights, um, mostly pieces you can find in the house. Uh, but we can also work on projects like uh, interiors or I don't know cars. Uh, anyway, it doesn't matter. We we like to to play with uh, all these uh, different uh, possibilities. I can talk about um, one of my first pieces. Um, it was a few years ago in 2005 or six. I designed uh, with uh, Yona Vautrin, another uh, young French designer. Um, this ball you can see here, it's uh, uh, called Panier Percé. Um, this uh, editor, they first started with rapid prototyping. Uh, we were doing exhibitions with other uh, young designers and some of these uh, rapid prototyping pieces um, became some real products and th th this one was one of the first um, and we didn't knew it, it was going to, to be uh, in porcelain we just wanted to, to do uh, something particular kind of uh, difficult uh, to do with all these holes it's a nightmare to do but uh, in China they have a, a very good knowledge of uh, to do this uh, fine uh, uh, pieces and um, they managed to, to do it also because we had the rapid prototyping pieces to do the mold so it was a combination between uh, technology and uh, very high knowledge of, uh, of the material you, 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 when you buy the objects it's empty uh, and you can do whatever you want uh, but we, we, we gave to them um, a drawing, an example of what they could do and mostly they, they follow uh, the, the example but uh, the most creative people can also uh, do their own uh, customization. This piece is made of uh, two parts, uh, the, the structure is in metal and the, the piece on the top is made of hand-blown glass um, by um, a, a craftsman uh, with whom I, I'm usual, used to, to work. I like to, to work with these guys because uh, it's very uh, impressive to, to look at them uh, doing these pieces in very big molds of wood uh, and it's the same way to, to work like uh, 30, uh, 300 years ago and, uh, but they, they like, some of them like to, to work on um, contemporary and modern pieces and it's very interesting. Um, so I presented these pieces by my own. I made the prototypes by myself and looking for an editor. This time with this project I wanted to, to have a different approach and instead of working on a, on a brief uh, I wanted to to bring um, an, an idea, a project, and to find the right editor. And uh, a few months after, uh, an Italian editor uh, who made uh, lightings um, called me because he was interested by the project. He saw it on the internet. He didn't, he didn't saw the project uh, at the fair, but hopefully now with the internet, uh, people can look uh, from everywhere <laughs> what you did so he saw it and he, he called me uh, to because he wanted to work um, and to start with these projects and after perhaps if it works on new projects uh, of lights so the experience was good and uh, I hope we we can bring the, the product into production and this this last year the we saw a lot of uh, new French uh, editors like uh, um, La Chance, uh, Superette, uh, uh, or Galleries. Um, it, was, it wasn't like that 10 years ago. And thanks to this new 
generation, um, I think the young designers can show their work to, to the world. So um, thanks to that, uh, we, uh, French design is uh, shown uh, all around the world. And um, I think it's a progress uh, respect to yeah, five or ten years ago. Uh, um, it's not that there is much more talent. I think uh, ten years ago th there was already s some very good designers, but uh, it was more difficult for them to to work with uh, editors. Or, um, but there are more and more designers too in the schools because uh, uh, young people. Uh, the, d the design is. Uh, um, one of the jobs, no, on the métier, uh, uh, jobs, jobs you, you, uh, that young people want to do now. I don't know why, perhaps because we can see on TV, on magazines, a lot of uh, articles about uh, how to do a better house, or, and it's more attractive. The field of uh, design of where we can uh, propose to, to bring our um, creativity is, is growing because uh, uh, the market is very hard now and, uh, and people understood that we, you, you should have a nice product uh, to be able to, to be visible. So, uh, that's a good point, in, in a way. Uh, the crisis uh, uh, forced them, forced everybody to 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 do a better work, so uh, a better identity to be different from the others. Uh, some nice products to be uh, to make the difference, and um, so I think we have a, a great uh, great opportunities. Uh, and there is a lot to, uh, more to do. It's never uh, finished. So, yeah, I'm not too afraid uh, for the future. Um, I think design uh, can be can bring uh, always more. So.